Hey everybody, thanks for joining us for another episode of the Fight Bros Podcast. It's me, JB, the Ultimate Writer, and today I am catching up with Dan the Hangman Hooker. He's his very own UFC fighter, uh, and one of my favourite fighters. Now, um, tell us what it is you love about spending time in Thailand, especially at Tiger Muay Thai, and why you find yourself being drawn back there time and time again. Um, here I'm just surrounded by a, a bunch of hungry, young innovative guys you know and we more than having a coach just standing there saying do this 100 push-ups blah 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 you've got to do this i'm surrounded by a bunch of intelligent guys and we just feed off each other you know one will have oh i have an idea i think we should start moving in this direction and then we can have a discussion and feed off each other and oh i don't i'm not sure about that like i think you know, so it's it, there's a lot of interaction. I think it's a lot it's a lot better environment for me. It it keeps me motivated. It keeps me hungry being surrounded by all these hungry young guys. You know, yes. as opposed to just going into a gym, being told being told what to do. Like I think I was um, very independent for so long and and figured out a lot of things on my own. Then it's it's hard for me to just get told this is this is the way to do it and and don't ask any don't ask any questions you know now you know Saeed will come in and he'll say hey we're gonna do three rounds of this and I'll say okay yep but why and then he'll have to explain why we're doing it and then I'll start picking it apart and he can explain it and so it's yeah it's a real creative environment and I guess that's that's the best and we all we all just demand excellence. We demand perfection, yeah. which is the thing. I, I demand perfection in myself, and per- perfection's what you have to be aspiring to to really achieve anything in the sport. So it's the environment here. Just and it, I look forward to getting up every day with this environment, which is exactly what you need. It keeps me hungry. Yeah. Being here keeps me on my toes. Uh, nothing great was ever achieved in a comfort zone. For sure. If, if, if you know what I mean. Yeah. In New Zealand, if, if I'm sitting back on the couch, you know, I, I'm comfortable. Yeah. And when I'm comfortable, I, I start getting nervous because that's not when I, I perform my best. Yeah. I perform my best outside of my comfort zone where I'm constantly being tested, questioned, and uh, evolved. Awesome. Nice.